Uh, didn't I go to Katwa? I uh, hope you guys had an awesome day. It was boiling hot where I am. Uh, so we'll get straight into it. The word of the day is Tūranga Waiwai. Pronounced Tūranga Waiwai. Uh, this word pretty much stands for the place where you can call home. Uh, this word comes in two parts. The first part is called Tūranga. Uh, tūranga comes from the word tu, and tu means to stand. So Tūranga means sort of like a foundation. Uh, ranga sort of like makes the word into a, like a um, state of like sort of, you know, expanding on the word stand and leading it into the foundation. So that's Tūranga. Um, the second half of the word is YY. Now, YY is a really cool word. Um, most of you might know YY to mean legs. Uh, it's actually got a bit more to it than that. Uh, YY also stands for your legs, your feet. Uh, it also stands for your footprint. So everything in that region, um, in the region of your legs, uh, that's what would be your YY. So you know, whenever you're walking, um, skipping, hopping, or whatever, using your YY, whenever you make an imprint in the sand or in the water or tracks uh, on the beach, uh, if you go for a walk, um, that that's your YY as well. So um, physically and philosophically, uh, YY has a place in those two areas. So <clears throat> we'll combine the two. So that's where Tūranga YY comes from. Um, Basically, the extended meaning is um, the place where my footprint lies, and where my footprint lies is where I call home. So that's the whole meaning of Tūranga Waiwai. Now, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, a couple of ways to use it as an, in a sentence. Um, I've read it on the article. I'll just pull it up because I don't remember the sentences. Uh, it's the trouble with writing things, you forget what you write down. I guess that's why you write them down in the first place. Okay, so the first sentence goes Ko toku kainga, ko heretaunga, koina toku tūranga waiwai. And that means, my home is in heretaunga, that is the place where I call home. Um, so yeah, like that, that's one of the main ways to use, one of the main ways to use tūranga waiwai. It uh, doesn't always need to be like that. Uh, the other way you can use it is to refer to a person. Um, as sort of like a personification of how you feel about that person. So the second sentence that I've got goes, Koina toku kōwhatu, toku māpihi mauria, toku tūranga waiwai. And that pretty much translates to, uh, he is my rock, my object of affection, the home where my heart is. So, you know, you can, <clears throat> you can really make something that already has a de uh, deep meaning, uh, into something that uh, you can make even more beautiful and say it's someone you love or you know someone you really care about and yeah so that's it for Tūranga Waiwai um, if you like what you see like it I guess comment in the comments below if you've got any questions and I will see you guys on Friday um, definitely be making more videos of these from now on because uh, I reckon it's working and hope you guys enjoy it ciao